Before I dive into going through bank payments and bank receipts, it's worth just showing you how to view the postings to each of these nominal accounts, so viewing the activity on each account. You'll see we have a balance here. We have debtors at 342. There's a balance here for creditors, 186. VAT control account, there's a balance. And then that's about it. All you need to do to view the balance on each account, to view the activity of each nominal account, is find the account you want. Click on this drop down list. You have edit, delete, and run reports. If you click on run report, you'll be taken to a new page which will show you the postings on the accounts. You can see we can change the date here. You can view the activity on the account for the last week, the last 90 days, the last financial year. Whatever it is you want to do, just change the report period, click run report. You can then view the activity on the account. Now, if there are certain nominal counts that you want to edit or don't need anymore, just go to that same drop down list, click edit or delete. If you click on edit, you can change the description, the name of the account, even the category or detail type. And you have the option to delete the nominal account as well. I will now show you how to record expenses and receipts from the bank account.